with your melody seduces me. The way you undress sound slowly and glide your voice into our earlobes. That is to say, I cannot stop listening because I am delighted by the sensations you cause. My heart holds no applause. My voice lauds with you. I shower you in praise, Shade Adu. Everything about you is on a pedestal in my mind. I cannot find a reason to refrain. You braise my soul with your sauce, girl. You tempt me to skinny dip in these emotions. I could swim laps around your soulfulness. Your eyes are my personal lost and found. I rotate your track listing, body rolling my torso to your bass lines. I close my eyes tightly, furrowed brow, folding like Venetian blinds, shutting out the sun. Your soul blocks out the sun. Your voice takes me dark. Let's embark on this mood together. My fingers snap along to the cadence. I am moaning to your moonlight. I am a bloodhound sniffing out the pureness of your residence within any room. And when I pick up your scent, I am rent as the heavens like rain on a sunny day. I am an addict since every yesterday that came before today. See? 
sitting here waiting for you would be like waiting for winter. Living dense in your expense, but I'm tired of dealing with the denial struck a nerve and as sharp as a dissonance in the chords. I can't afford for us to be distant. I said I love you, love you more, though at times I'll be tempted, though at times I'll be helping. Our vices, rhymes, and impressions can't compromise. Too busy trying to invest in a piece of mind. Fail to lead and retry. Fail to lead and retry. Take a step back. Sometimes I rewind to memories before Emery and the wine. Okay. I say. Let me think. <laughs> okay. Look. Is it cool if I pull out my phone? <laughs> Y'all won't hate? All right, for sure. Okay. I say. nervous. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Let's get it. There's a lot of right arms in here. I say. Perfect. Okay. You spark you the spark to my flame when existence mundane. Your design is contained of crystallized filament strains. Our conditions the same. Electrical currents and flame. Every inch of my face while surges surge through my brain. That's about it. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna hold up y'all time too much. I already kind of stumbled off it, but matter of fact, I got something else. Matter of fact, look, I'm about to rap. Look, I say, they don't love you till you gone. Look, at least what I've been told. I've been trying to keep my sanity. Hands on the wheel, panicking. I gradually lose control. I swear I gave music my all. Every last strand of my soul. Can't lie, I feel so damn good to see the smiles and they crowds when they staring at my souls. Look. Manifested what I jotted in my notes, look Squad invested so I changed up the approach, look Hand me my flowers while I'm here or make a toast And my legacy will last lifetimes even when I hear no more, look I'm just a young gun running up for the throne So give it up cause everyone claim they own They frontin' by where they from, not care about being known They brewin' beef just praying they catch a buzz and maybe those, look I was stressing, trying to lessen all my burdens Burning sages, smoking haze, just praying that God to get these demons off me Remember Clutch, uh? Oh, you're going hard on that. Look, look. Take it. Okay. Can y'all slow down on the band real quick? Let me just try to go in on this. Look. I was stressing, trying to lessen all my burdens, burning sage and smoking haze, just praying that God to get these demons off me. Remember attaching QR codes to all them roses. My senior year, Valentine's Day, hoping these up around click on my link. Remember mobbing at the rock box, passing out thousands of flyers independent. It was just me, Caleb, Kobe, and JP. So the most tickets out of every last artist that attended was time out Chris Blakey. Find a way not to pay me. But that's a damn saying. Truth be told, it's a boy's world, a man's game. If that's how y'all rockin', it's my turn to change the landscape. Broski said, don't never change for the fan base. I promise you everything worth having, can't wait. That's about it. I'm sorry, I held the mic for a minute, but. The transition, kind of convey the transition, what that's been to go from one of America's most deadliest trained killers to changing lives with a smile on your face. How you doing? Right. Uh, because a lot goes into that, you know, you, you, you get out and you, you, you feel like you've been lied to. You, you, you really do, because you go in thinking you're going to be this freaking Captain America with your shield and your M16A2 service rifle, right? You're going to do all the pictures and you're going to be like Rambo, you're going to do all that stuff. And then you start to see both sides of it where uh, you, you hear from your family about the propaganda that's being put out there, but then you're being told to go do something totally different. You're like, well, wait a minute, why do I feel more like a pawn than anything, you know? And then you come out and there's people thanking you for your service. You're not entirely sure how to feel about that, right? They're talking to you like you're Batman, you're coming home feeling like you're the Joker, and it can be kind of crazy. Um, we won't spend too much time on that subject. We navigated that, I'm in a better place now. I hope other people get in a better place, and what I'm gonna do for you here tonight, uh, I hope kind of, uh, kind of makes sense with what I just said. Uh, so here we go. Okay, sure. It's really short. It's really sweet. I'm gonna try not to pull out my phone. When a man's heart is filled with deceit, it burns up and dies. And a dark shadow falls over his soul. And from the ashes of a once great man has arisen a curse, a wrong that must be righted. 
So we look to the skies for a vindicator. Someone to strike fear in the same black hearts of the men who created him. Damn, I was on a roll too. That felt really good. To strike fear in the same black hearts of the men who created him. The battle between good and evil has begun. And against an army of shadows lies a dark warrior. A purveyor of good with a voice of silence and a mission of justice. This is me. Thank you. Pena. Like 236 days without performing uh, after 11 years straight of performance. So it was weird, but go ahead and get into this. Shout out to the band, you are awesome. And whenever y'all are, well, I'll start it so y'all can get it. Um, I look above trying to follow the clouds Cause down here everybody wants to follow the crowds I'm a man of adventure that's in love with the sounds Tell my side of the story when I'm rocking these towns Cause I refuse to be a local act in my mid-thirties And go outside the city and nobody knows me Treat a fan like a friend and welcome like family So when I drop a CD I know where my support be I talk about the struggle cause I'm struggling And you can relate cause that's where we've all been If you can tell I'm hungry for this, I'm starving. Rich thought you get it for free, it's a bargain. CBD sparking just to ease the tension. The dead man walking in another dimension. Trying to connect everything in the world through my eyes with my head in the air. Chasing skies, uh, yeah. underneath the stars, uh, underneath the stars, underneath the stars, yeah. Underneath the stars Death is for certain Tomorrow isn't promised But if my predictions come true Like Nostradamus With God's guidance This music, I got this Trying to mute my spoken words But it won't be silenced My art of storytelling Is equivalent to a felon With all murder charges That's my life behind bars I'm chasing skies With the moon and the stars When the red lights through life See me passing all these cars You can't tell me that my drive is a Vin Diesel, Fast and Furious Part 9 Turbo boost in my mind to keep the feeling alive Screaming world peace, run a test and I'm believing in the face Eject me out the game of life, open heaven's gates Avoid the inevitables like kids do vegetables Speak from my soul and live my days like festivals I'd be rich without seven figures before the decimals Underneath the stars Underneath the stars, underneath the stars, underneath the stars, and I got one more for y'all. Thank you, thank you. Uh, since vocab's here, I'm gonna do this one. She she loves this song. Damn right, I do. <laughs> Listen for the sound of the lost cause. Scream out with locked jaws. The journey's never ended for the pinned in. I don't know when, I don't know how, but it's coming soon. Any day now, any day now, any day now. Yo, it's coming soon. Any day now, I don't know when, I don't know how, but it's coming soon. Any day now. These faded thoughts never felt so sober. Right in the detox, even when the feeling is closer. Yeah, the feeling is closer, don't want to feel when it's over. Yo, my passion is burning, it won't diminish or smolder. Death is booming colder, dropping toxic in my mud vein. This cold rain feels like fire to the king of pain. Something's coming and I see it through the blurry aim. Keep it moving, moving silence like a Hanukkah cane. Not paranoid, just prepping for the days to come. The test of time would decide if I stand or run. Heard it all before, they said chance will come. Success or trouble, I'm expecting either one. It's to the point when I sleep, I feel the stage presence. Pray to the heavens, till my lungs are breathless. I point to the heavens, faith in everything I vow. And it's coming soon, any day now. Listen for the sound of the lost cause. Scream out with locked jaws. The journey's never ended for the pandemic. I don't know when. I don't 
know how, but it's coming soon. Any day now, any day now, any day now. Yo, it's coming soon. Any day now, I don't know when, I don't know how, but it's coming soon. Uh, the long walk of word stalker Dr. Jekyll went to hide and came back a monster Could have been a product of the morning after Instead channel my anger The taken then became the taker No angels on the outfield But angels on the corner Cause the devil gets bitter When he sees you doing better Couple of like minds Stay on top like a header No comedy central But we stay drawn together I wouldn't put this much time and effort in the hobby I'm trying to see the world I'm trying to move somebody. I'm a prophet, rewriting all the prophecies. Jay made some rules, I'm adding some policies. Dreaming with my people, trying to get these fantasies. Riding, making ripples through planets and galaxies. I see where I want to be, and I know how. And it's coming soon, any day now. Listen for the sound of the lost cause. Scream out with locked jaws. The journey's never ended for the pending. I don't know when, I don't know how, but it's coming soon, any day now, any day now, any day now, yo it's coming soon, any day now, I don't know when, I don't know how, but it's coming soon, any day now, thank y'all so much. I remember when we met, you extended out your hands, it was the beginning of such a phenomenal friendship, and the moment destined from the depths of the distance. These whispers in the air thrust to see you again. I fly like the wind to show you the true ability of a man. Only God knows how much affection that I hold within until you return to me like the waves meeting again with the sand. Whispers in the wind will confirm to you who I am. I'm prepared to be the prince to protect you to the end. The miles of the map cannot exceed the passion spoken with each breath. Listen, princess, there's no other relate. There's no other that relates like you can. But yet, what is a king without a queen throughout all the land? The land? Ambitious but still appropriate when I make my advance. No more secrets that I hold, but complete compassion so that your soul can comprehend. And yes, I'm persistently preparing for this moment for it may be a last chance. Let me do more than put a ring on your hand but shift the universe as the seas and the sky and the stars all glance. For they all hear the wind, they all hear the wind brings to our reality a remarkable alliance as these whispers call for you, whispers in the wind. Thank you. So I do a lot of poetry. Um, I do it in English, Spanish, and Portuguese. So I'm gonna switch it up for you guys and do something in uh, Brazilian Portuguese. Dama da diaspora, com os lábios da liberdade, ela fala uma verdade dos nossas horas. Você pode ver, pode ver de possibilidade, embora a distância faça a vida tão dolorosa. E se o canto é de uma sinfonia de tal unidade, senhora da diaspora, é uma hora. Você já viu uma outra aliança, como está nós em Américas. Nos conhecemos no ano internacional de dos afrodescendentes. Dois, intelectual, de inicial de uma herencial tão autêntica. Um momento em que a história entendente deixa minha carta flui através de oceano com sinceridade. Você se lembra de nossa dança de um destino negado? Porque nós somos em uma ilusão negra que se estende em estado. Mulher sofisticada e que eu disse obrigado. Dama da diaspora, que eu sei mais que um campeão do seu coração. E por isso, e quando nossas mãos se unem real de um combinação, e quando de América de Norte e América de Sul conhecerão. Esta minha carta dedicada à Dama da diaspora. Uh! Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Thank you. My name is Tony Polanco, and I appreciate you having me here. Have a wonderful night, everybody. Feel like motivated and happy and energized, and then you're around other people that are like, rah, rah. that's why we have Debbie Downers and things like that. So, anyway, I'm here to spread inspiration. And if you haven't heard about Rise Above TV, we're all about empowering humanity and supporting unity. I'm a mindfulness coach, and so I'm all about creating a mindfulness movement. So if you're into being authentic and being real and living intentionally and deliberately and mindfully, then you might really love Rise Above TV. I'll be posting some of this poetry. The arts are very healing, and I believe all of us are here to rise above all of our limitations and division and all the things that find us into being like small and constrained. And we all are, I believe, superheroes with amnesia. And we must awaken to our true supernatural powers that are actually natural and light your shit up. L-I-T, living in truth, T-R-U-T-H, the real understanding to harmony, S-O-U-L, S, seek out unconditional love, soul. Be real, responsible, empathetic, accountable, and loyal, be safe. Seek the truth, accept accountability, free your mind, and express and expand your heart and live and lead in love. Yes, sir. I'm an acronym geek. For whatever reason, God, creator, universe speaks to me in this way, and I love it. So, okay, so my brother had this, my brother's a musician. I mean, an artist like a genius on another level. And he wrote this song back in 2012, and I was like, dude, that shit is so dope. If I ever, and I won't say if now, when I go on tour, when Rise Above TV goes on tour one day, on the side of the RV, it's gonna say, do you think you're alive? That's what the name of this song is. And to me, it was like an anthem. And I wish he was here to sing it, or play guitar while I attempted to sing it. And I was really looking forward, I'd never done this before, when I was thinking about, what am I gonna read tonight? Something said, read, do you think you're alive? Now I wanna sing it, and I thought, well, I'll have the balls to do it because I'll have musicians back here and they'll, they'll give me some rhythm and it won't be so scary, but they're gone. <laughs> and here I am. And so I still want to do this, this one, all right? So here we go. believe in you. Thank you, I appreciate y'all. And I honor you each greatly. Just each of you are very special. Let me just say that, okay? Recognize your specialness. Just wait one second and I'll tell you why your eyes are dreaming. You think you're alive? I'm here to tell you that this is all pretend. Imagine a world that you could create. Don't second guess chance. Don't ever doubt fate. Coincidences that didn't ever exist anyway. But you always thought that you were right. And your ego stole you of your light. And it's not that hard to take control of your own soul. Oh, do you think you're alive? Now you got it yourself here to forget and lose fear and to take control of all that you know. We're in a constant state of remembering what we forgot. The light at the end of the tunnel is here and for years you just thought that it had disappeared but now looking back, were you true to yourself? Did it help? But you always thought that you were right and your ego stole you of your light and it's not that hard to take control of your own soul. Do you think you're alive? So good, right? Doesn't it get better? Ugh. True freedom is the absence of limitations and the presence of possibilities you never thought were there. And I don't care what you've been told, just spit it out and let it go. Let the truth be known. You're coming out alive. You're worth it, oh yeah, you're worth it. Yeah, you're worth it. You deserve it. Do you think you're alive? Amazing. 
It seems strange that she could be offended The same orders are given by her Said I said this before now You said I was childish And you'll say it now Remember what I told you if they hated me, they will hate you. England's not the mythical land of Madame George and Roses. It's a band of police who kill black boys on mopeds. And I love my boys, and that is why I'm leaving. I don't want them to be aware that there's any such thing as grieving. Young mother down at Smithfield, 5 a.m. looking for food for her kids. In her arms she holds three cold babies. And the first words that they learned was please. Thank you. First time sharing my poetry. I'm not good at stage over there. No. I'm not good at what's it called? called? Your stage left. Oh, stage, stage left. left. Okay. Here we go. Well, I guess I'll just start and Woo! share my po poetry. Uh, all right, this one's called Paradoxes. Is this oppression a thinly veiled attempt for attention? I wouldn't know because these days my intentions are clouded by fear and insecurity. Learn from young age, pity parties were meant to be private. Heavily stigmatized, so I learned to stay quiet. Scared the worried eyes with tainted motives, staring down at me. Compelled to stick their hands out, but I'm not looking for a handout. Uneven playing fields worse than the rocky uneven playing fields worse than the rocky foundations, which has become all too common. But with that, my frantic antics are a cry for help because I'm stuck between a rock and a sunken place. That's, that's the first one. The second one I'll be sharing is home. Again, I'm not very, very good at crowd work, but, uh, <laughs> but I, I wrote this poetry. Stop insulting yourself. You're great. I wrote this poem, you know, during quarantine. I so. Gave a lot of time for self-reflection, thinking about what's important to me, you know, my values, what, how I want to live my life moving forward. And uh, simply put, the poem is called Home. Home is where the heart is, heart is anchored to the porch, to the futon, to the screen, catch slight glimpses in my dreams, filled with lush trees, makeshift tire swings, hamatan breezes, much like said breezes, these reconstructed memories disperse as quickly as they came. Home is where the heart is, held together by familiar faces, unsaid words, promises without a name. It weaves through words of reassurance, the biting remarks, the snark only a lifelong observer can muster. It's the closest thing to unconditional love, fleshing out the definition of grace through practice. Commandeered by life, home is my rock, my big, beautiful, old rock, anything but static. Home is where the hurt is. My head is cluttered, it's a mess. I'm fumbling with the keys, mindful of mindfulness, stumbling into this strange place. This neglected fixer-upper in need of legroom and headspace, I take inventory. The holes in the carpet were like the gaps in my memories. The exposed wiring mimicked feedback loops tangled to such an extent I can't discern the beginning from the end. The lavender wallpaper makes it seem like the walls are in constant motion, contorting the corners of the room, refusing to calcify like ancient hieroglyphics its curious design carries meaning. Yet with every jerk, bend, fold, twist emotion motion evades comprehension. It's gonna take some elbow grease. But I'm ready for spring cleaning. I'm ready to make this vessel a home. You Thank go. you. you are done. Conceptions. I like the way it sounds. It's conceptions. I have a great voice. Huh? Conceptions, they crisscross like tracks, running your mind as sparks cross over from time to time. Dumping gold stresses behind as she's yielded by life, yet flashbacks of yesterday's time spring back to her reality, ruining the reality of reality, lighting up flames only to make way for a new potent to intake. 
Only destined to succeed, failure don't flow through blue veins, which lift underneath her beautiful brown skin. Reality is back at it, and it's time to clock in as her eyes crave green faces that say nothing but mean everything. Buying only temporary happiness when you is all she needs, but her mind faints and needs to need more. More of you and less of what you come with, that quote-unquote total package, free shipping and handling. She rather stole beneath the grave and call it a day. Knowingly and aware of the player's status you obtain, her score is always higher. Never slipping up on the games you play. Sparks lift, vanish through thin air as she ghosts. Evidence of trees, all stems, no leaves left to soothe her appetite to lonely expectations and deprived disappointments that lay at her doorstep, otherwise known as lost souls. Thank you. According to, according to, ooh, ooh, according to, according to you, poetry. God's work in human hands. May we be worthy of the pen we hold, submissive as a sacrificial lamb. Call it Holy Communion. Bold as the ink drops, the culture pops effervescently by motto and creed. The blood never recedes, only goes silent momentarily. In the interim, when the time comes, please supply us everything we need. Quail the intrigue for the allure of the flesh. Grant us the anointing to bless. Let your light emanate through our skin to manifest. May molars and incisors chew on the fat of you and digest this truth according to. Succulent and satisfying as stewed meat or anything covered in gravy. I am covered in clay, Lord, and loving the way you made me. Through the living word, you persuade me, woo me, prove yourself to be my sufficiency. This beauty is all-consuming. My quill is trembling like feathers in the breeze. My mind can't keep up with this delicate writing. My heart is scribing. And I do believe that I have known what the divine has shown upon like the dawn. Saffron and marigold, scarlet and yellow, ambers and halo. Your love flows like a river into my palms, saturates these psalms in the still and quiet, calm hours of sleep. You creep into my heart song. You sneak into my conversations with elders. You slip into my steeping tea. You snuggle your way into my intimacy with like-minded human beings. You serenade me with this wisdom that you have stored up for such a time as this. You bid me to speak your words and forbid me to remain silent. So how could I resist? You've entrusted me with your parchment in hand because through me you know you can complete the work. For he who began a good work in you will carry it through according to. According to, according to, according to you. According to, according to you. Poetry. So now I'm gonna do something from memory. I'm gonna do a piece that um, I'm gonna to have to do probably in the very near future for a wedding. So it's like my signature love poem that I pull out whenever I need to feel like all um, warm and fuzzy inside. And it starts with singing because all my crap starts with singing. <laughs> You are the passion in my ebony. You are the love inside that sets me free. And when I close my eyes, you're all I see. You are the passion in my ebony. These are the words of Talib Kweli. He said, you must live in the infinite black that exists when I close my eyes. You must live in the infinite black that exists when I close my eyes, stemming from my imaginative wisdom, my ability to clone your substance into dreams. To me, that's what he means and how witty the conjured state of being I fathom you in, loving every extension of your epidermis. 
limbs of a sacred body, so come. Envelop the portals of my thoughts like you always do. Wrap around the surface of my dreams and plummet to the base so that within every crevice that I imagine I will see your face and all the empty space is now void. There is no absence in the absent parts just fulfilled like every hope I had when I met you fulfilled like every promise I could ever make to love you fulfilled like my destiny must be every time that you look at me baby I swear I see the bigger picture concerning us so from the dawn until the dusk even after eternity begins to rust please trust that I will always love Above all else, I want a sacrifice of myself to give to the memorial that we make together. Above all else, I will endeavor to pay homage to that memorial in which I treasure. And it will be my greatest pleasure to love you until the celestial bodies begin bowing. And even after night has stopped howling and day has ceased hissing, after the universe touches its other end with galaxies kissing, you will never find me missing any opportunity to say how much I love you in every way. My heart cannot, will not sway from this decision. More than I can envision when I close my eyes, you begin to obstruct that blackness, filling up the skies of my pupils, retinas, optic lenses, until that blackness descends from sight altogether, never to return. I now realize that my sole purpose before I met you was to yearn and earn the right to love and learn how to give it in an unconditional form so that my heart could properly perform for the rest of etc. And you could never measure the width of it, nor could you weigh the depth. Cannot wrap your thoughts around it and begin to accept how much it truly is, because it's as vast as that infinite black the very one you must have come from the very one in which you now live you are that innumerable factor that summons me to give my love in an unhyphenated unadulterated fashion so in the midst of light i close my eyes and imagine you bathed in that ever developing ebony that contains my undying passion indeed baby you must live in the infinite black that exists when i close my eyes, and you are the passion inside of my ebony, my ebony, my ebony. So that's that piece. Thank you so much. I freaking miss looking at people and being receiving your energy immediately as I speak, it feels so good. I'm sick of Zoom. <laughs> I'm sick of Zoom. <laughs> sick of looking into a lens and being like, shh, are they there? <laughs> but um, what a pleasure, um, what a gift to think about all the things that we definitely had taken for granted for so many years that now are so precious. And some of them that seem so absurd, like blowing out candles like how disgusting does that seem now in context <laughs> of freaking COVID-19? It's like, oh, there's a cake. Oh, you about to blow your spit all over it? Oh, no, nah, I'm not eating a piece of that. But back in the day, we were like, we were lining up to get that cake after someone spit all over it. And it was great to us. We were like, this is delicious. Are you, what are you doing? Get some cake. So um, thank you, Paula, for having us. And well, is someone coming back to the Mike Kenyo? I felt like the oddest ever not knowing what's happening next. <laughs> Uh, Nala, where you didn't do something, or are you chilling tonight? She's chilling tonight. Okay. Paula, are you, you got words for us? Let this be the day. Dang it. Welcome back to the stage, rich and open, harm, and et cetera, beautiful men, and maybe a sprinkle of Joan. You are the best sprinkle. You're like that Dijon mustard that no one knew was like stone ground and delicious, and once baked upon chicken would make the chicken the most delicious damn chicken in the world. Yeah, you're the new Dijon mustard, Joan. Don't let him tell you no different. <laughs>